Good day everyone! Welcome to Math with Teacher Justin. On today's topic, we're going to talk about rewriting linear equation into standard form. Alright. Okay, so a linear equation in two variables is a first degree equation that can be written in the form ax plus by is equal to c, where a, b, and c be real numbers such that a and b are not both zero. This form is called the standard form. So our standard form is ax plus by is equal to c, where a is our numerical coefficient of x, b is the numerical coefficient of y, and c is our constant term. Now here are some guidelines for us to make sure that our equation is in standard form. Make sure that the numerical coefficient of x, which is a, should be positive, wherein for b, it can be either positive or negative. And for c, it can be any real number. Let's have some examples, or let's have some examples in writing our equation in standard form. All right. Okay, so for example, we are given this equation and we are going to rewrite this to standard form. So, so first thing that we need to do is for us to place all the variable term on the left side and all the constant term in the other. So we're going to apply the addition property or subtraction property of equality. So in this case, let's transfer negative 4x to the other side of the equation by adding both sides by 4x. Or we can just simply transpose negative 4x to the other side. So we will have 4x plus y is equal to 5. And this will be the standard form of our equation. Alright. Okay, so let's have another example. So for example, we're given this equation. Now again, first step is for us to transfer all the variable term on our left side and all the constant term on the right side. Now in this case, we have 5x. So we transfer 5x to the other side of the equation, changing the sign. So we have negative 5x plus 2y. And then we also transfer our constant term positive 6 on our left side changing the sign so we will have negative 4 minus 6 now after that simplify if possible so let's simplify we will get negative 5x plus 2y is equal to combining like terms negative 10 since the numerical coefficient of x is negative Let's divide both sides by negative 1 to make it positive. Dividing both sides by negative 1. So make sure that our numerical coefficient of x are always or is always positive. So we will get positive 5x minus 2y is equal to positive 10. And this will be our standard form. All right. For example, we're given this equation. So in this equation, we have fractions. So first thing that we need to do is for us to transfer all the variable terms in one side of the equation and all the constant term in the other side. Okay. So in this case, we need to transfer we need to transfer 3y to the other side and our constant term 5 over 2, positive 5 over 2 to the other side. Okay, when you transfer a term to the other side of the equation, you change the sign. So we will have 3 over 4x minus 3y is equal to negative 5 over 2. Now, in this case, since we have a fraction, Okay, since we have a fraction, and if you want to have a whole number as your numerical coefficient of your standard form, we must multiply both sides by the least common denominator of all the fractions that are present in our equation. So, we multiply both sides by the least common denominator of the denominator present in our equation. So, 4 and 2 so that least common denominator of 4 and 2 is 4. We multiply both sides by 4. 
So we distribute 4 to each term. We will get 3x minus 12y is equal to 4 times negative 5. Negative 20 divided by 2, we have negative 10. And that will be our final answer. So this will be the standard form of our given equation. Alright. Okay, so let's have our last example for today. So for example, we're given this equation. So in this case, we need to simplify first all the coefficient of our equation. So let's apply distributive property. In this case, we distribute our coefficient to our group. So we will have 12x minus 14 is equal to, let's distribute 5 to each term of our group. So we have 15y plus 10. And then after that, let's transfer all the variable term right and all our constant term in the other so here we are going to transfer positive 15 y to the other side of the equation and our constant term negative 14 to the other side of the equation okay so we will have 12 x minus 15 y is equal to positive 10 plus 14 simplify by combining like terms we will have 12x minus 15y is equal to 24 and that will be the standard form of our given equation all right now that you already know how to write a linear equation into standard form it is your turn to try it please click the link in our description box below in order for you to test your skills that's it for today. Again, I'm Teacher Justin. Goodbye, God bless, and stay safe. See you on my next video. Peace!